Mrs. Holmes here. We're going to talk about how to grease the main tuning slide on the trombone. What? I know, weird. But instruments are mechanical things and they need to be maintenance. And one of the things we're going to be doing is learning how to do that with the main tuning slide. So this part of the trombone, I just have the bell section, this part of the trombone actually comes off. So if I pull, there it is. It comes all the way off. This is called the main tuning slide. In order for this to continue working, and we don't really talk a whole lot about this section in beginning band, but if you don't grease it every once in a while, it will get stuck, and then you have to get it professionally repaired and untaken, or untaken, taken out. Yeah, untaken, sure. So first thing you wanna do is you wanna wipe off all the old grease with a paper towel or a cloth. And the reason we do that is because if you put it on um, and there's still old stuff, it can kind of get gooky and it'll, it won't, it won't be as good. Just listen to me, do this, okay? okay. All right, next, there's a, many types of uh, greases that we can put on the main tuning slide. There's just simply tuning slide grease. It comes in a little tub like this. There is multi-purpose oil that can go on the tuning slide. There's this red gooey stuff, that, which I actually love and I use all the time. My French horn player, French horn has nine slides. Yeah, so we have to grease a lot of stuff. This is really good stuff. And then probably the most simple is this chapstick looking one. It's not chapstick. I mean, you could put it on your lips, nothing would happen. It would just taste gross. You could play a trick on a sibling though. Anyways, the one I'm gonna use today is the one in the little tub. So all you have to do is take a little dab on your finger. You don't need a lot, just a thin layer is gonna go on there. And I'm gonna rub it all over the part that goes inside the slide, not the part that's on the outside. So for me, it's like a, it's like a golden color because my trombone is silver. I'm gonna get a little bit more for the other part that's on the actual instrument. I know this is fascinating, right? So you're just gonna kind of get it all over there. Instruments are kind of gross, but your kids, you'll get used to it. And then when I, before I put this completely in here, I'm gonna put one side in first, wiggle it around, and then another side, wiggle it around, and put it back on. Sometimes you have to put it in an angle and kind of wedge it in. And now it should move up and down easily so that I can tune my instrument. We'll talk about tuning later this year, but just so know that should move. <clears throat> and that's how you grease your main tuning slide. We're gonna talk about how to oil the main slide on the trombone. This is the slide that makes the notes change. Again, it's locked right now, so I'm gonna unlock my slide, take off the entire thing so I only see the under part of the slide. Gently put this down, try not to drop it. With a paper towel, just like we did with the main tuning slide, we're gonna wipe the entire thing off, get all the old oils and gook off of that. All right, now, there's a couple different things you can use for your main slide of the trombone. There's the multi-purpose oil, which is totally fine. If you just wanna get this, you can use it for both parts of your trombone. But if you wanna be really cool and, um, really have a good maintenance on that moving part of your instrument. This stuff, it's by Yamaha. It's called Trombone Slide Lubricant. It is the bomb. All trombone players love this stuff and it, you just need a little bit and it will work for a while. You don't need to kind of reapply. Basically with trombones, your slide, when it comes up and down, it should move freely. It shouldn't get stuck. You shouldn't hear it making sounds uh, and it should be moved, it should move like everything else like your arm moves in and out it should feel it should feel effortless this makes that happen so i'm gonna unscrew i'm gonna put some just down the slide on both sides it's kind of gross looking but it's the bomb remember the bomb and i'm gonna rub it all over so there's an even coat amongst the whole slide. This is the most basic thing you can do for your slide, and for beginning band, this would be adequate. Wipe off my hand because it's all gross. 
when you put the slide back on, make sure that the little um, ledge that hooks to the, the lock goes against the lock side. You can actually put the slide on the wrong way. So making sure I'm lining that up, I'm gonna put it on. When the slide, I should just be able to do this and it should just come back down real easily. If it gets stuck, do it again. That's how you work with the slide and make it clean and make it work really well.